Here I'm Darren Riles here at Wax Research and uh, I want to go over my wind paste race wax. Here I want something that uh, I could apply easy on the skis wherever it was. I mean here in the shop it's easy to do it here but when you're in the parking lot on top of a mountain after skiing or hiking um, late in the day just getting off the chair. This is a product that's like really simple to apply on the skis and uh, makes them go a lot faster. Especially when skis get dry and don't have any wax, they slow way down. And uh, coming from a race background, I know the benefits of, of fast skis. And in racing, it's all about time, getting down the bo uh, bottom of the mountain as fast as you can. It's uh, really important to have a well-prepped ski. But even for free skiing, and trying to charge out to get to the powder stash quicker than anybody else, or smoking them on the flats, you know, down to the, the chairlift for another lap, um, it's, it's, it just feels good to have skis or run on, underneath your feet. So this is the puck. It's easy, slips in the pocket, fits anywhere. Um, this wax is great because it doesn't get cold, even on the coldest days. And you just take this felt pad and you get a little bit on there. And what I like to do is, is do like a circular motion, just applying it like this, little wax on, Karate Kid style. Get on there, just do this like circular motion and then just finish off going tip and tail back and forth, really rub it in. Because the thinner the layer you have on the skis, the better. If it's really thick, it'll actually stick. That's why when you hot wax a ski, you want to scrape it and brush it. And the ideal way is it's like, that helps for a quick application, the, uh, the felt pad, but then it's also nice to have a brush. And uh, you know, you're not gonna be carrying one of these around the mountain, so that's why we have the felt pad there. But if you really want to get the best uh, benefit out of this thing, the, the most durability, Finish off with a tip to tail, just scrubbing motion on the base. And you really get it deep down there a little more and it just sticks around a little longer and you'll feel some fast skis down the mountain.